Hey everybody, welcome back for episode 2 of Resident Evil Revelations 2. Which is called, I fucking forgot. We'll find out here in a second. Previously on Revelations 2. Shit happened. Bitch. Bum, bum, bum. Okay, contemplation. Whoop did he fucking do to So bought myself a new vaporizer. This thing is fucking awesome. And suddenly infected. So tonight I'm vaping some Pluto. Pretty good stuff. That Thompson's? Yeah. I'll be examining this. I hope it's not Chris's blood. I don't remember seeing you guys in Resident Evil 5 though. What were you doing in Kujuju? Or Kjuju, or whatever the fuck it's called. West Africa. Gabe? You don't fuck with a Redfield. Redfield. You're alive. Alright, get up. God, you owe me a pair of underpants. You're a bitch. Come on in. He's okay, too. Well, I knew it was you guys. Right. Uh, any requests? Yeah, summon every enemy in a 50-mile radius. You got that song? Set. I need to get a new one next month. <sighs> then again, the damn things. Mm. We woke up in the middle. Three or four years old now. How about you? Some kind of rundown prison. Gabe. Gina's dead. Oh, shit. Thompson's gone. Yeah. But I remember to take his bracelet. Eddie would want me to find out how it ticks. You chopped off his fucking hand? Cool. Sometimes you have to make the hard choice. Come on, let's see what's in this building. Come on, bitch. Ain't, ain't no king's curl bar of haste, but... Welcome to the brink of true fear. The 
overseer. What do you want? Cryptic bullshit. Let me just undo the door so everything can get in. Zombies, come eat me! Anyway. Okay, so... We have a lot of cloth. Gunpowder. Actually... Well... If we combine this with the stinky chemical... Tiny... I gotta show you something over here. Yeah, 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 you show stuff, whatever. Oh, wait. Should be using you. Wondering though Wait, how the lights are on in that one house. Me, 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 me. Hmm. I'm still wondering exactly how deep, like, this if it's an actual zap system, like in, uh, ew. Oh boy. Oh, hey, you have quite a number of explosives as well. I'm wondering if it's actually like a, a true zap system like in Resident Evil 2 or like how intricate it actually is as far as if you pick shit up as one character how much it affects when Barry comes through later. Because as we saw in the last chapter, if you don't turn the fire on, then buried that you don't have to do the extra little step to turn the fire off to get out of the prison. You just gotta go, hey, look the door. And then I run around here and just thumpity 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 doo da. Hey Claire, come walk with me, ah? No, I don't want to. I'm looting. Dickolificus. I'll well pick up as much stuff as I can now before you know. You know all hell's going to break loose. I mean, it's a given. There's no spoiler to that. You know shit's going to go down. One way or another. The descent of shit will happen. So, it's presently, well, okay, technically it's Sunday morning, but, yeah, still gonna be a few days before, hey, look, a tiny hole. Ah, that'll get rid of that. Still going to be a few days before episode 3 comes out, because, you know, 
Somebody had a stroke of fucking brilliance when it came to this one. Fence actually gets knocked down at some point, but uh, yeah, the door requires some manner of assistance to get into. Amateur archaeologists, you need a drill. Time though, going to be popping up a few videos. Well, I'm going to be starting another Let's Play in, in the interim. Ah, more gimmick box. That's up by a fucking mile and a half. Buy a pixel. This is not hyper accurate. I forgot what was in there. One of the gimmick boxes has Moira's expansion pack. Um, other ones just have parts, and one has like the shotgun ammo case somewhere. I forgot where. Same thing for. Um, Same thing for Natalia. She gets her she gets her expansion bag. Except hers is like really late in berry section, uh, in like this little warehouse kind of room with some annoying, ass, big fat annoying ass enemies that like to blind you. Yoink. I don't do guns, but I will throw a fucking explosive at something's face like no tomorrow. Kind of like the whole thing on how priests in ye old olden days would only use blunt weapons because it's like, oh, we can't, you know, cut people and draw blood. But we can beat the shit out of them, crush their bones and shit. I think that's actually a rare part in that. I think it's a three lock chest too, which we won't see what part because I already have it, but you know, just just saying. Uh, and of course there's that. Some more gunpowder. Cause you know, sticking gunpowder in a glass bottle makes a explosive yeah. Oh, Fisher's okay. Fisher's fucked. Neil? Neil was with you? Yeah. We got split up on the way here. Oh, wait, hold on. It's a horror thing. You get split up. Uh, yeah, he'll probably be fine. More go. Ooh. I almost didn't see you. I mean, it's only 100 BP, but, yeah. And if you do wind up maxing out all the skills, and you start wondering to yourself, well, what about what do I do with all the BP I get after that happens? Well, 
one of the, I forgot which menu, but one of the menu lets you convert your BP into gold for raid mode. Which I'm actually having quite a bit of fun with. Stinky chemical. Can't take the stinky chemical. Moira box. that to her. And then you should take the stinky chemical. And then she should do that again. Because, you know, Yeah, reasons, I guess. Onward and upward, through the tall grass where I probably won't be able to see anything shimmer if there is anything to shimmer with a shimmer and a shammer and a shim shim shim. Technically true to Resident Evil standards, red herb does. In this one, it multiplies your herbs, but still makes a red and a green makes three green, so it still triples the effectiveness, so to speak. All right, stupid, open this up. Tool. We're gonna find exactly what we need in this ship dump. From my experience, yes. Help me look. Okay, I think it's about time to. Yep, it's time to commence the breaking loose of the shit. I guess we're not alone out here. You go first. You are my shield. You have a crowbar. I mean, come on. One of the greatest badasses ever used a crowbar. Of course, he had a, you know, king's crowbar of haste, but... And power armor. But yeah. If I remember, I think we have to go to the first... Rolled up door? Which I think is over here? Yeah. Oh, don't scare me like that, Claire. Look, check out what I found. If you see any weak walls, I bet I could drill through. Okay, you at least have a shotgun. See if there's anything we can use inside. Traveler's Diary. So, I found this little island in a dusty old book, and it's not listed on any maps or anything, so I thought, cool, a chance for adventure on an uncharted island. I'm so there. Chartering a helicopter to get there wasn't cheap, and as soon as we touched down, the locals seized the chopper and took me into custody. So not cool. 
And now I'm locked up in this dirty old room. These dudes are whacked. I can't explain how, but you know how you just...